Hi, Dr. Emron here with Spring Cure, and today I want to talk to you about something that's on everybody's mind, aging. Now, as you get a little bit older, a lot of people start to think that they can't do what they used to do. And in some ways that's true, but in many ways that's actually false. The reason that people can't do what they used to do is they're not doing what they used to do. So if you're not exercising like you were when you're younger, when you're not running around like you were when you're younger, then you're probably not going to be able to exercise and run around like you were when you were younger. The thing, second thing that happens is when we're younger, we're, our bodies are really resilient we're still flexible we haven't had a lot of damage to our body but over time we accumulate injuries and in, in, in all of our joints and all of our muscles that can show up later on when we don't have perfect nutrition and we're not exercising regularly so making sure that our nutrition improves over time and that our exercise improves over time can help keep that resilience and help us recover from those injuries so we can continue to do some of the same activities we were able to do when we were younger now, it's really important that we keep these things up because if we let them go for a period of time, it becomes much harder to regain than it is to maintain. The other thing that happens over time is we have changes in our hormones, and for women, that can mean significant weight gain. But by maintaining a healthy diet, it can help reduce a lot of the fluctuations in hormones that result in weight gain. In men, the same thing happens. Over time, as we gain weight and as we age, our testosterone levels can go down. In fact, becoming a father can actually drop your testosterone levels as well. Now, don't freak out that's actually a good thing. It means that we don't go crazy every time one of our kids runs around and we don't kill them because our testosterone levels are still high enough to run around after girls. But it does mean that we have to work a little bit harder to maintain our health. We need to make sure that we keep off any extra weight that's going to produce estrogen that's going to fight our testosterone. So making sure that we exercise on a regular basis and we maintain healthy nutrition on a regular basis helps to keep some of those symptoms of aging from getting the best of us. The other thing that that's going, to, that's going to do is one of the things that happens as we age is on our DNA, there are parts at the end of the DNA that keep the DNA from getting frayed. It's kind of like a rope being snapped. Every time we, our cells divide, that rope is getting snapped and the end of the DNA will eventually fray and those cells will die. So what happens is we have a cap at the end of the DNA called a telomere. That telomere is protected by healthy eating. When we don't eat healthy, the telomere gets shorter and shorter until eventually our DNA starts to fray and we can't repair it and our cells start to die off. That's aging. So we want to make sure that we prolong our life and we maintain the quality of our life by doing those things on a regular basis that are going to maintain our health so that we feel good, we look good, and we live to our full potential. Thanks a lot. Hope you got a lot out of it, and we'll see you at the next video.